Valkyrie done, Goliath done. And it looks like this group is going to be moving out. Yep, and that is what they're doing. Marines kind of scouting around, trying to catch an Overlord off bounds. Just barely missing this one. This attack force moving in here. Fairly able, and it looks like they'll be able to take care of uh, any mutilist threat. I don't know if Crazy Wad has built any anything else. And here's the mutilist coming. So four mutilists to three wraiths and two Valkyries. I think Strafe is going to have the upper hand in this battle if there is an engagement. Moving up here, but no Overlord in sight. Marines kind of there to cover. Looks like a lot of Scourge being produced. Six Scourge. An engagement here. And it looks like there might be a uh, Overlord going down. One Mutalist going down. All the Mutalists down. Scourge coming up. And it looks like they're able to take out that one Valkyrie. Everything trying to fly back. These Marines able to take care of that one. Driving off this other Scourge fairly fast. Units retreating to uh, repair. Looks like a couple Firebats have been created. And a dropship full of glass, so... We're going to see a drop here fairly soon. Let's see what the upgrades are. That plus one air armor just about to finish. And that'll be crucial for any more mutilists. Or it looks like more scourge, in fact. And I think this is going to be plus two ground armor. Yep, that's going to be plus two. So he's going to try and toughen up his drones a little bit in case there's any economical harassment. Zergling's kind of burrowed there. And it looks like repairing some of his wraiths. That's going to be helpful. That saves some minerals. Another Valkyrie being produced. More supply depots. I wonder if Cloak is going to be researched here at all or if it already has been. It's quite possible that it already has been. Comstat going off. Patrolling those Scourge around. It's kind of a good idea Uh, kind of keep his airspace clean. However, he needs to do that over his uh, economy area. These units kind of circling down around, getting ready. Wraith's already cloaking, so cloaking has been up, has been researched. And that's going to be uh, crucial against these uh, Scourge, as there are no overlords in sight. Dropship unloading uh, the Goliaths that are going to provide air support. Firebat's going to move in, and it looks like they're going to go straight for the extractor, try and cut off this gas. Looks like one of the Valkyries going down. This Valkyrie kind of pulling back behind the Goliaths. I wonder if these Goliaths are going to be able to take it down. Oh, oh no, it doesn't look like that Valkyrie survived. Dropship still hanging in there. Looks like the Zergling force is going to be moving up here. Try and take out these Goliaths. Scrape is concentrating everything he has on taking down that extractor, and it will go down at the pierce. Just one fire bat left. Burrowing the Zerglings. I have no idea why he did that. Extractor going down. That one Scourge getting taken out. These Scourge going to pop. This dropship's going to evacuate the area just in time. These rates are going to be able to make uh, short work of this Scourge. All the rates concentrating their attack force on the Spire. Goliath moving to protect that uh, dropship. I don't know where those Scourge went to. I think they got taken out by these Marines. Or, no, it looks like they are up here just hanging out. Really needs to move an Overlord back here so he can take care of these, uh, these wraiths. He really needs to get his, uh, economy going crazy while he's falling behind here. This spire is going to go down. I have no idea what he's doing. Oh, he's got an expansion here. I don't know if that's going to be up in time enough for this. Dropship loading up with fire, more fire bats, and that looks like Crazy Wallet has left the game. So this is GG for Crazy Wallet. Hope you guys have enjoyed this. And I will see you next time.